What's up guys, Darth Slater here. I hope everybody's having a good day today and everybody's been having a good week. Only one more day till Friday. Just gotta get through today and uh, we'll get to Friday. <laughs> but uh, I hope everybody is going, blah, blah, doing good, having a good week. And uh, yeah, I hope every, uh, all, everybody is still in school, is doing good in school. Uh, should be coming up on the end of the school year. Hopefully uh, everybody be doing good on finals and whatnot if you're still taking finals. And if you're working, hopefully, uh, um, I don't know when you would get off for the holidays, but hopefully that's coming up for you. Hopefully you're looking forward to seeing family if you haven't, if uh, you're seeing family or hanging out with the family that you live with. But uh, anyways, um, let's get to today's daily devotional. And uh, before we get started, as usual, I'll say that I did not write this book uh, the devotional book I'm reading it from uh, is you can check out in the description down below the details of the book. It's called Everything I Know I Learned from Sports. It's a one year devotional written by Josh Cohen. And uh, while you're down there checking out the uh, details of the book in the description, help me out, hit that subscribe button. And if you want to continue following along the series, hit the uh, notifications button. And uh, but, anyways, let's get to today's. Uh, but this is one of my favorite verses, is today's verse. And uh, we're also on day 43. But um, today's verse is Philippians 4, 13. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. And today, the name of today's devotional is Always Content, Never Satisfied. Athletes everywhere love to quote Philippians 4, 13. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. You see it in sports a lot, whether it's Tim Tebow's eye black or Steph Curry's shoes. But do we really know what the Apostle Paul is talking about here? He gives us context in verse 11 and 12 when he says, I have learned in whatever state I am to be content. I have learned both to be full and to be hungry. Paul is saying that Christ gives him the strength to be content in every season of life, rich or poor. I have a motto in my life that says, always content, never satisfied. It's good to, uh, to have drive and determination. You shouldn't be satisfied with where you are right now. God has more for you. He wants you to do better. Maybe you don't have your dream job yet, you know. I'm not content with 107 subscribers, which is where I am currently at uh, at the recording at the time of recording this video. So you know, help me out with that. <laughs> but uh, maybe you want to own your own home, get married, or have kids. Those are all great pursuits. Don't stop striving for what's next, but don't let striving rob you of enjoying the moment you're in right now. Find a way be to be content right now, whether you have a lot of money or you have none, whether you are married or single. If you are having a hard time finding contentment, ask God. He will give you the strength because it is through him that you can do all things. Man, that, was, that was a really good one. And uh, that was something, that's one where you, act, like, you should take to heart and always remember that um, to always be content with whatever it is that you have because you could have, you could be in worse circumstances. I mean, if you're living and even if you're living in poverty in the United States, you could, it could be worse. There's worse places to be. You could be living in a third world country. And uh, I have been to Haiti twice, and I definitely know have, and I've seen that the living uh, conditions there is it's, it's awful. But just, just always thank God for what you have and be content with what you have. But always still continue to strive to want more or to uh, achieve more. Don't don't just be content and settle. Be content and work for more. You know. And uh, but um, let's uh, let's not be content, or let's be content with our zoo. But uh, let's build onto it some more and build another exhibit. And uh, that is going to be the exhibit of the American Plains, because we have I bought these animals: three bison and four pronghorn horn antelope. And uh, we're going to be building a pretty big enclosure for them. And um, so let's get that started. Which path is this? Um, oh, I guess that works. Let's, uh, is that straight? Oh, no, nah, I need that to extend first. Uh, let's get the angle snap going. Why is it going at such an angle? It's so weird. Oh well, it's fine, I guess. I ain't gonna worry about it. I ain't worried about it. Oh uh, yes. Can I extend it this way? <laughs> no. Yeah, that'll do. Um, let's 
cool, I guess. Uh, but, uh, oh yeah, what kind of barriers? I was looking at that the other day. I think I want wood logs. It says it's climbable, but they're on all fours. I don't think they're going to be able to climb wood logs. Don't you think? I mean, that's just that's just my opinion, but I don't think they're going to be able to climb. And it's going to be, I don't really want to always just have these. I should probably change this from brick to something. Oh, I don't know. They might be able to climb it. Maybe that one. That's a good one, too. It looks better than the brick, to be honest, but it'll also look better. No, I think I might be able to change it to wood eventually. I should have done that in the last video. All right, let's uh, let's get that started, though. Uh, let's change this length to, yeah, let's have this at 20. I'm telling me it's going to be a large exhibit. Hmm, that is very large. But, there's going to be a twist. Uh, let's have that deleted. Um, that ought to do. Alright, now I have to just figure out a couple of things <laughs> that I don't remember. Um, wait. No. Uh, this button? No. No, 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 oh, definitely not that, oh, no, um, ah, there we go, yes, what button, oh, yeah, alright, cool, oh, wait, no, what was it, G, nope, U, I think, I think it was U, Oopsies. Do I want the... No, I, I think this is good. How do I make it go down? Oops. Oh, well. Yes. Um, let's make this width a little bit bigger. Let's make this just one more out. Nope, come back. I guess just go that way one. Um, yeah, that ought to do it, right? Is this all the same size? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that looks good. That looks good. Groovy, baby. Alright, cool. Uh, barriers. Wood. Let's not make the length 20. Let's see what happens with 10. Now we need to make this shorter. Oh, shorter. 8? No. Let's go to 6. Oh, not 5. 6. 7? Nope. 6. What? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? Why won't it, uh... That is, uh, very weird. Um... Okay. it let me build is it too close to the sidewalk oops wrong one uh, 
I think it was too close to the sidewalk. Let me just lengthen this up a little bit more. Five meters ought to do it. Yeah, that ought to do it. <laughs> that looks really nice. <laughs> uh still get that people won't go back there right, it's just a game it's not like it's real life where people are gonna travel wherever they want <laughs> um cool all right terrain i'm making this a lot bigger than i what i probably intended to Water. Let's see some water in there. Oh yeah, that ought to do it. I'll change whatever I want to glass later. Um, I just want to get this going first. Terrain again. Oh. ditch going for the I guess a lake or not a lake just a water water area you know gotta have them have some fun and have a drinking area you know All right, let's get it in there oh yeah oh yeah a lot better than the other one um that ought to do for now this is a very large um but uh Let's do this. Tools cube. So, um, let's go pyramid. Can we go any bigger? Oh yeah, let's try a pyramid out. <laughs> Three pyramids over here. Oops. Uh, yeah, push in. Bro, shizzle. Cool. Let's uh, make a big cave, I suppose. Oh, yeah, this probably isn't the. Uh, <laughs> Let's increase this percent a bit. Let me decrease the size. Be a little bit more precise. That's what I'm doing. Oh yeah, let's get this nice and rounded out. Nice and covered. Oh yeah. Come on. Come on, Lee! This is a uh, turn out to be a nice overhang area. I can't put it that close to the fence because uh, I have found out in the past that the gazelles like to climb these rocks and they will jump over the fence. They're crackheads, you know. Daggone crackheads. Is that deep enough now? Mm, might need to go a little bit further. 
I increase this by 10%. in a little bit better. Let me increase this one. Th uh, that's good. The four is good. Okay, push that as much as I can without breaking through, I guess. Trying to flatten it out a little bit. Just get it sloped. Oh, yeah, this is coming together real nice. Real nice. Alright, let's decrease this by a little bit. Decrease the size by a little bit. Smoothen this out a little bit more. It's kind of steep, isn't it? Actually, increase the percent. Trying to get it so uh, sloped, you know? Or so steep, I mean. I need to paint this uh, soil so that I can actually see what's going on here. Just a little bit better. Just not be that size, though. Cool. Is this slipping it out good? Nice and flat. Oh, I can flatten, can't I? Oh no. Alright, flatten, flatten the surface, I guess. Oh no, 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 no. Let's push that back in. Push that jump back in. Alright, cool. That should be good. Um, habitat, bedding, um, I kind of like the leaves, let's do the leaves, oh my, oh yeah, this is, this is, um, yeah. This is uh, very realistic, as some people might say. Let's just delete all that, though. Um, should be enough, though, right? That little bit. I should be good with that. Or they should. Um, let me see if I can... I need to pull this up a little bit more. Let me decrease this size. So I can just like straight up pull it out. Yeah, that's good. Oh yeah, this is turning out quite nicely. And then I'm gonna have to put some heaters in here during the winter time, keep them nice and warm. Because I believe they do it cold. Especially the chillins. The chillins get very cold. Yeah, whenever they start popping out some babies, you know. Oh man, we're already 20 minutes into this. But I guess we don't have to put so much more. Probably won't get the animals into the. This is gonna, definitely going to be a two-part episode. Um, but getting, I guess, this the scenery right is the uh, what I'm going to do today. Like doing this part, I'm going to do two of these, maybe even three of these. But, um, but is that covered up enough? Oh man, I need to do that some more, don't I? Man, this is taking forever. Can I increase this percent? Oh yeah, this is way faster. I don't know why I didn't do this before. Let's 
versus a lot better. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, well, it actually looks kind of cool. I'll take it. That actually looks pretty cool. I, uh, I definitely did that on purpose, though. <laughs> actually doesn't look that bad. Is that? Oh my. Oh my. Alright, there we are. Is that covered up enough? No, I might need to cover it up a little bit more. <laughs> this is actually a lot of fun doing this. That stuff. Kind of get this all nice and covered up and be done with it. Alright. That should be fine. Let's just expand this just a wee bit more. Alright, that should be good. I guess so that they can get on top, I will do this. Actually, no, I'll just do pull. And just have a nice slope. Look at that. Uh, and then I have to push in a little bit. Nah, that's a little too steep, isn't it? Push it in just a wee bit right there. Alright, maybe that's uh, good enough for them to be able to get on top of here. So let's just sit this up a little bit. Alright, that ought to do it. Maybe they can get up there now. Who knows? Um, yeah, at least save this just in case anything happens. Um, sweet. We're looking, uh, we're looking good over here. Got one shelter down. Excuse me. Oh, we're actually. Hmm. Ah, yikes. Did not mean for that to happen. Wait, water. And, oh, wrong button. Water. It reaches that. That is not reached, unfortunately. And power. Power should be fine. Um, let's see. Yeah. That took up a lot of time. But, um, let's go to this side, I guess. Um, under here. Could I build something under here? I probably can. Yeah, let's try it. Pool. Let's not have it at 100%. 60 would be good. Is there like a limit to this? Let's up this a little bit more and see if I can get it to do what I want. Alright. <laughs> 
<laughs> maybe, maybe I can't, or maybe I can dig further into the ground. making this uh just pushing it in a little bit i uh, i get so uh i guess caught up in the game so focused into the game i forget to talk i know sometimes that might be a little bit of a problem <laughs> but just how it be sometimes you know you know what i'm saying right, let's see if i can get any bedding in here Large leaves. Bang. Bang. Oh, yeah. That's fine. Get a little peephole. Actually, no, I want to close that. Yeah, I don't do it. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. And food, I would like to uh, also have under here um, for, for quality freshness, I guess. Um, food, arboreal. Um, let's go to uh, filters, species, American bison. Uh, food, chalk, large. Let's do it um, right in between these two thingies. And let's go to pronghorn antelope and see what they eat. They eat from the same thing, cool. I will put more down, but I just want to make sure I have one right there. I might as well just go ahead and get a water thing. Um, I don't think it really matters. Species, let's show that, let's try it again. Yeah, water loft charge, trough large. That ought to do it. Uh, cool. All right, so we got that one built. Damn, 28 minutes. All right, let's see if we can get time to get the third one built. Because why not? Stamp tool. Let's go with. Uh, let's try this bad boy. Let's see what happens with this. Push. Let's up this size to five, maybe. Yeah, I'll get it. I right, guess getting the wart done real quick, real quick, and real nice, real nice. Let's get this uh, bedding in here. Um, I guess that'll work. Um, <laughs> yeah, that ought to do it. Let's get this percentage a little lower. Just get it smoothed out, you know. All 
Alright, cool. That ought to do it. Let's pull this out a little bit. Just the size to that ought to do it. Yeah, it's up to a hundred. some more. I just had a good idea. I don't know if I'm going to do it though. Oh man. This way. <laughs> yeah, that looks cool. I mean, I don't need to have it up so high. <laughs> I'll do it right. Yeah, that should be good. Um, but um, I think, yeah, I want to, uh, yeah, let's build some steps, I guess. Cube, of course, the size is yeah, down like. Let's get up seven. Let's do eight. Yeah, eight meters would be good. Oh yeah, change that eight by. That ought to do it. All right, there, and then double this to 16. Have that right here, and then up this to 20. Have that right there. Push. A little bit from here, smoothing it out, you know. Have a little stairway for him to get up here, and yet again, I uh, keep on forget to talk. I I need to not be so focused in these games, <laughs> and then come up with a conversation to actually talk about. I'm not really good at talking to myself yet. Or with myself yet. I need to get good at that. I need to, uh. Yes, I just said that. I need to get good at talking to myself. But I think you. I think you might know what I mean. Uh, let's pull this up some more. We're gonna have a nice walkway for them, though, I guess. Need it, uh. Get it nice and smooth. So they're not like, uh, that ought to do it, I think. Probably should have done a little bit smaller uh, stairs and more of them. But this ought to do it for now. Oh, yeah. This is looking real nice. Push this in a little bit, I guess. Put this up a little bit, and this seam, I guess. Be cool if the animals actually get up here. I don't know if they're going to use it. <laughs> to be honest with you. I hope they do. Get up on top of this. That'd be pretty cool. All right, that, that should be fine. It looks good. Doesn't need to be perfect. I mean, there are these are animals. Oh man. All right. Well, I guess I'll uh, 
finish this tomorrow or no it's not tomorrow in the next video but uh actually free sweet but this is gonna be a very large enclosure probably need to get more animals than what i already have in here or have purchased but i have that big old thing that big old thing and that big old thing so i guess we had a pretty good job did a good job today uh, probably should need to make this little rockier just to not look so artificial you know <laughs> um but uh yeah i hope you all enjoyed today's video maybe you learned something how to do something i think i did this with the u button u for up i suppose <laughs> but um yeah i hope you all learned something from today's video hope you enjoyed as well and if you did you know hit that uh, like button if you want to continue following along with the series hit the subscribe button and hit the notifications turn them on but uh, anyways, I hope you all have a wonderful day. I hope you have a, continue to have a great week. And this is for his glory. Peace.